let's pray for the kingdom of God to come. Matthew chapter 6 and verse 10. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. While Jesus taught his disciples to pray, he also asked them to make this prayer. Lord, thy kingdom come on earth as it is in heaven. The earth needs the kingdom of God to come in its fullness. When we consider heaven, heaven is the very dwelling place of God where his rule and his dominion is in entirety. Heaven is a place of God's power. Now, one of the things that we observe in heaven is that sin and its effects have no place in heaven. There's no sickness in heaven. There's no tear in heaven. Now, there, there is no work of the evil one. There's no oppression in heaven. Now, there, there is no sadness in heaven. No, there is God's power, uh, God's presence, God's comfort, God's love uh, in fullness in heaven. And while Jesus taught us to pray, asking for heaven to come to earth, you know, what we're really doing is we're saying, God, we want that kingdom of your power, oh God, to manifest in our lives. God, we want that power to manifest in every area, oh God, of our lives. And so we pray, God, Thy kingdom come on earth as it is in heaven. Now, one other thing about the kingdom of God that, uh, G, uh, that we read in the word of God uh, in 1 Corinthians chapter 4 and verse 20 is that the kingdom of God is not just a matter of talk, but it is a matter of power. And so uh, as we make this prayer to God, we can expect his power uh, to just invade you know, different parts of our lives. Now, if there's sickness, we can expect a healing to manifest. Now, if, if, if we are going through a, a, a phase of oppression, now we can expect the, the deliverance of God to be seen in that situation. Now, if you're going through a time of confusion and if you're going through a, a time where there's no clarity, we can expect uh, things to become clear uh, according to the wisdom that God releases into our lives. And so as the children of God, you know, we have this privilege to come to our, our God as Abba Father in any moment and say, God, uh, right now in my life, oh God, Father God, I want to see your power right the way uh, it is in heaven right now, oh God. Father God, uh, I pray that you will release uh, that same presence, that you will release that same authority and you will release, oh God, that same glory in my life right now. And as we do that, you know, we, we can rest assured that our God is a God who hears our prayer and a God is a God who, who gives us an answer uh, according to his riches in glory. So shall we just join our hearts uh, and pray and ask God and his kingdom to come into our lives. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, as you taught us, O oh God, to pray in this manner, to ask, O oh God, that your kingdom will come, that your kingdom will invade our lives. God, we ask right now, Father God, that your kingdom will come uh, in, our, in our personal lives. God, that your kingdom will come in our families. Lord, that your kingdom will also come, O oh God, uh, in our city, Father God. Lord, we pray that uh, everything that concerns us on the earth, O oh God, Lord, it will be a according to uh, your intention and design, God, the way you created all things to be conformed, Father God, to your word, to be conformed, O oh God, to your power, that, Lord, our lives this day may be conformed, Father God, to your power. And God, if there's anything uh, in our lives, Father, which, which are lacking that glory, which are lacking that power, Father, we ask, God, that, Lord, we will see that supernatural power released, O oh God. Father, that we will see a breakthrough. And God, we, we thank you, Lord. We thank you that it is your will, God, to bring the power of your kingdom into our lives, uh, which is why you taught us this prayer. So, Father, we pray confidently and we pray boldly. And Father, we thank you. We thank you for doing it in our lives. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.